It opens doors, this place. There's no two ways about it. I've known that for 25, 30 years. It's a tiny place, but it's always had one hell of a reputation. I think what I really, really like about this college and this course in particular, it's a really broad course, so we're given the opportunity to include as many materials as possible, work in whatever way we want. We can combine ceramics and jewellery or we can bring other elements into it as well. And the fact that we're not confined to our departments, we can go to other departments of the college and explain what we're doing and there's always someone there who's willing to help us. So there's just great support from all lecturers and technicians just makes it a really nice place to study as well as being a really close-knit community of people as well. See you, Tom. See you, Tom. One of the fantastic things about this course is the amount of different artists we've met, whether they've come here to work with us for a day or just visiting lecturers that have come here for an hour to give a an, you know, huge talk and they're not uh, keeping anything to themselves. They're allowing us to know everything about how they make things and where they go to sell things and how to sell your work. They're not just teaching you how to make something. They are really up in front as regards promoting yourself, thinking, where are you going to go and what direction are you taking when you finish here? I've gone more towards the jewellery side of things this year. So we've had teaching of traditional skills like claw settings, rivets, hinges, all the things that make work durable, but then being able to develop that in a really contemporary way, which I think has really helped me a lot. And another workshop we got the chance to take part in at the beginning was a ZBrush workshop. So 3D printing and designing on computers is such a massive part of 3D creating at the moment. I think a lot of people can see, you know, down here in Carmarthen and we're right at the end of the motorway. And I think for that reason alone, every single lecturer has made sure that everybody in London know that we're here and we're, you know, well, should I say a force to be reckoned with as regards our abilities and what we are able to turn out in the art world. And maybe for that reason, the whole system here works really hard to put the place on the map. The competition I'm entering at the moment is a pewter competition. At the moment it's very traditional, so it's trying to bring it into contemporary fashions today, really. And um, I jumped at the opportunity, really, because its aim is more along the commercial side of things rather than one-off pieces, so to bring it into high street stores. So what I've been working on is the neck piece behind me for the jewellery aspect of it, and then a centrepiece for the table for decorative art side of it. You walk through the door and you can feel the creative energy here. It's as though everybody's on the same level. The, the lecturers respect the students and the students respect the lecturers. And that's how everybody treats each other. There's no barriers here at all. 
between anybody. There's not one door that you can knock on. None of us want to leave. <laughs>